What's up everybody, this is Yudit Tanjin and Junan here. So, for example here, I sculpted this piece with dynamic topology. And if you have used dynamic topology before, you know that the topology are just full of meshy triangles, right? It's really hard to use for UV mapping, texturing, or for rigging, uh, that kind of stuff. And I need to retopologize it in order to make the mesh optimized for that. But retopologized mesh are generally very low poly and it doesn't have that high res details. So I want to show you how to regain scope details to a retopologized mesh and still keeping that low resolution mesh intact. So my workflow to do this is using subdivision surface, applying it and then using string wrap modifier and then use the model that I want to get the details from as the target mesh. The key here is doing it to one subdivision level at a time. Doing it simultaneously at really high resolution tends to cause problems like some vertices will snap onto the wrong surface for example. Now with the retopologized mesh, I like to make it just a little bit above the target mesh so that it has enough space for good surface snapping. Um, when the mesh started having quite a lot of geometry, I like to change the wrap method to project instead of nearest surface point uh, and also with the project method turn on the negative checkbox to make it work properly. Now here's the cool part, now you can use the multi-resolution modifier and use the unsubdivide button. It basically works like reconstruct subdiv in ZBrush. Now look at this. Haha, <laughs> now I have the low poly mesh with the higher sculpted details. Uh, now the old method is a bit finicky to me. Ken Trammell from CG Cookie actually made a video and I'll put the link in the description below if you want to see the old method that I pre previously used. So yeah, uh, if you have any questions, don't be hesitant to ask me in the comment below uh, and I'll do my best to answer them. So that's about it. Uh, take it easy guys. This video is supported by Wingfox. For those who are interested in creating real-time character from scratch using ZBrush, uh, Marvelous Designer, Maya, Substance Painter, and Marmose Toolpack, this in-depth course by Melvin Okoronko is for you. Uh, I'll put the link to the course and the coupon code for 15% off in the description below.